and welcome to VN Happy Hour. Hello, Happy Hour 2.0. Mm. Woohoo! people think about wildlife they think about the more kind of sexy and high profile species like lions and tigers and bears but I think we all do wildlife nursing in practice in the UK with our pigeons and our hedgehogs and various other things that turn up. To underpin any kind of work in exotics you just need to be as good a veterinary nurse as you can generally. All the stuff you learn at, at college or university underpins what you go on to do regardless of the species so if you're good at taking a blood sample from a tiny chihuahua you're good at taking a blood sample from a primate or a fish or the principles are all the same. When the spirit of our exotic nursing challenge I rather than a magistrate decided to ask everyone to go and find the three most exotic things in your house. The first prize winner will be getting £100, so it really is worth having to scurry around, opening some cupboards, move Granny out of the way, see if she's sitting on anything uh, interesting. Now it's time for our panel discussion, owning your future. But it's really important to get involved with any volunteering. It'll get you involved in things that you weren't necessarily expecting to. I've done a lot of volunteer work with BSAVA um, and it's involved helping plan congresses uh, and event management and, and diversifying into that, which I never thought my vet nurse uh, qualification would get me involved in. It's all about putting yourself out there. You can't sit on your laurels. You really have to use your initiative and just look out there for all the opportunities because they are out there. Make some noise, show off, tell people what you do. Be responsible for your own destiny. Can I have a drum roll, Rachel? I will do. We are about to announce the £250 winners of our top tip competition, Amber Colson and Pana Webster. Hi everyone, I'm Holly from Fit. Now I'm going to run through a quick recipe with you guys today, which is a lovely Mediterranean veggies in tomato sauce, which you can heat up at work and you can chop and change with lots of different things. Make sure to follow Holly on Instagram. She's got a whole channel dedicated to her kind of cooking feats, so the wholesome kitchen. The uh, challenge has had a phenomenal response. We've had some amazing entries. I'm amazed at what people have in their homes. I know. <laughs> it's incredible. <laughs> and after much deliberation, we would like to announce that the challenge winner for this month is Theon Anderson. But um, we have got two runners up, and you two are Kate Williams and Catriona Hendry. It's time for our Pay It Forward winner. Reading these is just, it's inspiring and it's so hard to pick one person. But this month, our winner is student vet nurse Tamsin Jeffries. Tamsin was nominated by Annie Deakin. She said, Tam is amazing. She has been by my side throughout lockdown and I literally couldn't have done it without her. 